Hey guys, Gary over at Shripwell. Just wanted to go over another common question that we're asked, uh, and that is how far does one bottle of QCS take you on a project? And it will vary greatly. I know some products, most products, have an approximate coverage area on the bottle somewhere. They kind of say how far it'll go. Um, it's so difficult to actually um, to <laughs> figure that out because every coating is different. Some coatings will require much more um, product to remove. Others will come off in like one coat. Uh, then you have, you know, paints and, and varying, you know, just all different um, elements that come into play. And so I, we don't really say how far it'll go. It really depends on your project and uh, just what the coating is, how thick the coating is, just things like that. Uh, and it will vary. So sometimes um, we've had, you know, a chair use a quarter of a bottle of QCS. But then we've also had, um, you know, a lounge chair. There's some mid-century lounge chairs that had a sort of catalyzed, uh, like a conversion varnish finish on them. And, uh, and that can take, you know, two bottles of QCS just for the one chair because that finish is really um, super, super tough to get off. Uh, even though it is, it is technically vintage, uh, it, it was just a very, very hard finish that they applied in some cases even back then. So, you know, it will vary. You'll have some times where you'll get a ton out of one bottle and then other projects where you'll get um, not that much. And uh, it, it will vary a lot and it'll, it'll depend on the project. So you really have to look at what you're about to start and consider, you know, just how difficult you believe it is. You're always welcome to send us a picture and say, hey, this is a project I'm thinking of starting. I want to buy some QCS. What are your thoughts on how much to buy? We'll give you the best educated guess we can. Um, you know, often the more you buy, the cheaper it is. So, you know, it has a great shelf life. So it, I would err on the side of having enough than running out. That's always frustrating when you're in the middle of the project and you run out. So I would always say buy a little bit more, but uh, it will vary. And again, we're here to help you as best we can uh, decipher what, uh, what you should do, but you're going to have to sort of get used to how QCS works and uh, make an educated guess and we can guide you in any way we can. But um, hopefully that helps. If you have any other questions, please feel free to email us and we will answer those um, if we can.